See, as you are very rightly saying, we genuinely believe that Indian shipping definitely has not realized its full potential. India is one of the few countries which can today offer a very solid cargo base. We are, I think, fifth largest importer of crude oil. We are, I think, th third largest exporter of iron ore. So, in terms of volume, our total exim trade, which is about 700 million tons, represents nearly about uh, 8 9 percent of the world volume of about uh, 8 billion metric tons. But unfortunately, the shipping in India has not grown as fast as it possibly should have grown. I definitely recall that about 30 years back, the tonnage in India and tonnage in China were more or less at the same level. But today, Chinese tonnage is more than three times that of Indian tonnage. And this has been particularly due to the fact that in many countries, including China, the governments have taken a you know, lot of uh, facilitative measures. They have adopted a lot of facilitative measures for the maritime segment, realizing that if the country's exim trade has to grow, which is an absolute essential uh, you know, uh, requirement for the country's economy to grow, then obviously the maritime capacity must be augmented very fast. And that is what China has done. And it is not only in shipping tonnage, but it is in every field of maritime sector. In terms of ports, today some of the Chinese ports, they handle many folds, number of containers that India as a whole in its, you know, I mean, 12 major ports and so many I mean, non-major ports handle altogether. Similarly, in terms of shipbuilding, today China is, uh, you know, the number two country in the world. It has actually surpassed Japan and they are projecting that by 2015 or little later, they will even surpass South Korea and emerge as the number one shipbuilder in the world. Whereas in India, though we have seen some growth, you know, India used to build only about 0.3 percent of the world shipbuilding tonnage about three, four years back. Today, that has gone up to about 1.2, 1.3 percent. So, okay, there has been some growth, but definitely with its uh, engineering skills, with its uh, comparatively cheaper manpower, I think India has a tremendous potential in shipbuilding as well. So, whether you look at shipping, you look at ports, you look at shipbuilding, everywhere there is tremendous potential for Indian maritime sector. And I think the only way that can be realized is through facilitative measures adopted by the government, both in terms of fiscal measures as well as in terms of, you know, other commercial supports.